part of reforesting the desert is water catchment. So whenever we have, a, when it rains, I come up here and I, I watch where the water flows. And this is an end catchment. And this is an end catchment as well. So that all the water that flows stays on, on site to feed our trees. Um, but basically, uh, you know, there's, there's, there's hills over here. <laughs> Wait, maybe I'll do it up here. There's hills over here and, and then it runs down into our camp. So we see these streams. And so we, we do like a, a stone catchment. It still flows, but it slows it. So the water goes into the ground. And then again, we'll put another one. We'll put another one until the very end. We can just do a big hole and it'll catch. And so all the water stays with us and then water's all over the trees. Does that make sense? <laughs> this one looks so much like an eye. I'm going to put uh, stones in the center shaped like an iris. Uh, maybe I'll put something crazy like a glass bottle in the very center or a big black round stone. And uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Then from up above, we always get drones flying overhead. Then from up above, it will look like uh, it will look like eyes in the desert <laughs> or water catchment. Hills and valleys are good. Hills and valleys are good for habitat and for water retention. <laughs> you see how it's all going to flow in there? We're awaiting a big rain. So <laughs> it's, it's such a joy. <laughs>